everybody today we'll be dealing with conversions which is very much useful for nurses and most of the nurses are worried about how to calculate that is the biggest thing now one thing that i would like to say you say is that remember that you usually might be doing certain calculations in the hospital sections so do not wait for any formula when you do a prometric exam or a had exam dha exam or even a cbt exam you will find calculation questions everywhere in such a case just use the formulas that is available for you or whatever you remember or you might be practicing it in the hospital so this is for those who don't know how to convert from a kilogram to gram or gram to milligram which my they might find very difficult now what we would like to tell you is that now conversions is like when you go down it's a step down the highest that we have is kilogram and just below that we have the gram which means you when you convert kilogram to gram you will need to multiply into 1000 now gram to milligram you will need to again multiply into 1000 when you need to convert milligram to microgram again you will need to multiply into 1000 milligram or oh sorry microgram to nanogram again requires a multiplication in 2000 so that is when you go down the steps everywhere you need to multiply in 2000 you have to just remember the order the highest one is the kilogram just below that is the milligram sorry the gram and below that is the milligram then the microgram and we have the nanogram so as you go step down it is in 2000 for example when you need to convert a 5 gram to microgram you need to just multiply 5 into 1000 because it's a step down now when you go above the steps you are going upstairs when you go up the stairs you need to divide it by 1000 that is when you need to convert 1 nanogram to microgram you need to divide 1 divided by 1000 if you need to convert a 10 microgram to gram again you need to divide twice you need to climb up the stairs twice which means for example what i have said is 10 microgram to gram so it is twice the steps so you need to multiply sorry divide by 1000 and once more divided by 1000 only then you get the answer so when you double the stairs down or double the stairs up it it divides by 2 or multiplies by 2 it doesn't mean that divided by 2000 or multiply by 2000 you need to multiply or divide two times by 1000 so mostly we get questions like converting a gram to microgram or microgram to gram so i hope the calculation back is clear so the thing is that milligram to microgram is only in 2000 whereas gram to microgram will require twice you need to multiply by 1000 same way we have the conversion of kg to pound since pound is the most common unit that is used in uk and us you need to know how to convert kilogram to pound the unit that is used in pound is lb when you need to convert kilogram to pound you need to multiply by 2.2 whereas when you need to convert pound to kg you need to divide by 2.2 for example if you need to convert 10 kilogram to pound it is 10 into 2.2 when you need to divide or you need to convert pound to kg for example 40 pounds or 44 pounds to kg you need to divide 
44 divided by 2.2 you have calculators in most of the exams so otherwise also in cases like uam oh you are allowed to carry calculator so which becomes easier for us to calculate otherwise yes you will need a base of max knowledge so i hope the conversions are clear for you thank you